In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to remove a SharePoint shortcut from your OneDrive. If you've been dealing with clutter or simply want to tidy up your OneDrive environment, removing unnecessary shortcuts can make a big difference. Let's get started. First, you'll need to log into your Microsoft account. Head over to your preferred browser and enter your login credentials on the Microsoft login page. Once you're successfully logged in, you'll be taken to your account dashboard. Next, locate the app launcher icon at the top left of your screen. It looks like a small grid, and when you click on it, a menu will appear showing all your available apps. From this menu, select OneDrive. This will open your OneDrive homepage and display all the files and folders stored in your account. Now look for the option labelled My Files on the left hand side. Clicking on this will take you to a detailed view of all your files. This step is crucial because it allows us to specifically identify files that are linked to SharePoint shortcuts. Once you're in the My Files section, browse through the files and locate the specific SharePoint shortcut you wish to remove. It might take a moment to find if you have many files, but carefully scroll through until you spot the right one. When you've found the shortcut file, hover over it with your cursor to reveal a small checkbox on its left. Click on this checkbox to select the file. You'll notice a set of options appear at the top, confirming the file is selected. From here, look for an icon with three dots, which indicates more options. Clicking this will open a drop-down menu with various functions you can perform. Look for the Remove option within this menu. Clicking Remove will prompt a confirmation message to ensure that you really want to delete the selected shortcut. Confirm your choice and just like that the SharePoint shortcut is removed from your OneDrive. Keep in mind that removing a shortcut doesn't delete the original file located in SharePoint. It simply clears up your OneDrive space. This is a great way to declutter and manage your files efficiently, ensuring you only have what's necessary in your view. And there you have it, a simple quick guide to removing a SharePoint shortcut from your OneDrive. I hope this step-by-step -step explanation made the process easy and clear for you. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe for more helpful tutorials.